It's my 30th episode of Romero Movie News, my 50th video uploaded to YouTube, and it's Halloween. It's like Christmas. You're watching Romero Movie News on fucking YouTube.com. Oh, God, for you! Hey guys, and welcome to Romero Movie News, the show where I give you updates on all movies, whether they be good or bad, but as always, we try to keep it good on the show. First bit of movie news is that 20th Century Fox revealed 2D sketches of Dracula in the upcoming animated comedy Hotel Transylvania. Uh, Dracula is going to be played none other by comedian Adam Sandler. The movie is set for a September 2012 release date, but if you want to read up fully on the plot details to the film and check out those 2D sketches of Dracula, click the link in the description box. Also, the first official picture of the Three Stooges finally has shown up online, and you got your Larry, Moe, and Curly played by their separate actors, and I gotta say, they're almost spitting images of the Three Stooges. Curly looks like Curly, Moe looks like Moe, and Larry... Nah, I'm still kind of feeling iffy about him, he doesn't... Nah. But anyways, if you guys don't know the plot of the film yet, it turns out this film is going to be modernized. Yes, it's going to be set in our current time and date, which kind of makes me feel uh, a little weird. Because it turns out they're going to go to their old orphanage to try to save it, and then they're going to end up in some weird reality TV show. And I doubt that in the 1980s or more like the 1890s, there were, you know, reality TV shows. Anyways, The Three Stooges is set to be released next year, but if you want to check out the plot details and the picture of The Stooges, click the link in the description box. Also, sequel news is that 20th Century Fox is planning to make an Independence Day 2 and 3 film back to back. And whether Will Smith will be in it or not is not a factor at this point, as 20th Century Fox mentioned. They will not sure if they'll actually be able to obtain him for the sequels. Turns out Will Smith uh, actually asked for $50 million to be part of Independence Day 2, but 20th Century Fox was like, mm, no, nah, we're good. And the project was actually slated and, you know, until it will be released basically in 2013. Turns out these movie will actually not be sequels, it will actually be one whole movie split into two parts. So, yeah, we'll see how that works out. Anyways, you want to read up fully on that story? Click the link in the description box. Now that the Fairley brothers are done with the Three Stooges after a decade of trying, they finally finished filming the Three Stooges film. Their new project is said to be a sequel to Dumb and Dumber. That's right, as soon as Jim Carrey is done with whatever projects he's done, they're going to ask Jim Carrey if he would like to get on board for the project. You know, this is something that I find pretty f exciting because, you know, Dumb and Dumber is a classic. So to have a sequel with, you know, Jim Carrey, you know, and I keep forgetting the other actor's name because he really hasn't been in anything for a while. But anyways, yeah, I'm just so excited about that. You guys want to check out the full story on that? Click the link in the description box. Last bit of movie news is kind I wouldn't say an exclusive, but it's not a story that no movie news show has covered. I checked Peter Rawlis, Beyond the Trailer, several other YouTuber movie news shows, and no one has covered this story. The story is that the first official CGI test footage slash teaser trailer to Guy King has shown up online. Guy King was a popular 1970s cartoon show which was actually titled Shogun Warriors. Guy King was actually one of the main characters in the anime show, but it turns out they are trying to make a full length feature live action film out of this. It's kind of like uh, Samurai meets Transformers, the show. Uh, but actually, the movie has already been released in Japan and has been slated for a 2012 release here in the States. The CGI test footage has been out for about a year, but no one really actually paid much attention to it, at least movie news shows on YouTube didn't. So, if you guys want to be the first I guess to check out the first CGI test footage uh, slash teaser trailer of Gag King, make sure to click the link in the description box. Well guys, this is all the news I have for you for episode 30 of Romero Movie News. Always remember that all of today's stories are linked in the description box. Always, I advise you to follow me on Twitter, friend me on Facebook, and add me on Google+. As always, I got your back, so you're on track. Happy Halloween! You've been watching Romero Movie News on fucking YouTube.com. Click this yellow button, what don't you fucking understand?